Hey fatty! In this video I'm going to talk about fast weight loss and slow weight loss. So fast weight loss, that's what I do. I fucking knock body fat off people like it's going out of style. They fucking lose 20-30 pounds in like one month. Like this is common results with me, especially with people that are quite obese. Like I got one girl right now who's down 30 pounds in two fucking weeks. Like, this is fucking unheard of. You're not going to get these kind of results with fucking Jenny Craig and Weight Watchers because they're still fucking gobbling down food six times a fucking day. The only way you're ever going to get a result like that is fasting and not fucking eating. Straight up, okay? So, there's absolutely nothing unhealthy about that. We were meant to fast. I went through this 50,000 times about it's a natural way for us to heal. Our GH gets cranked up. Um, everything heals when you actually give it a rest and you're not stuffing food down your fucking face all day long. But the main things why fasting and losing body weight very quickly is fucking optimal is because increased motivation. I go on the internet and I see people on diets and the first thing, they, their motivation gets decreased when they lose weight slow. They can't see the change. They're losing like a fucking half a pound a week or a pound a week or even three pounds in a week which is usually just fucking water. Until you lose a good 10 pounds, you're just losing fucking water. That's the biggest one. And because this leads to shit like this. Much higher success rate when you got increased motivation. People will actually stick to it. And you get amazing results because you actually stick to it. And it, so it's obviously more sustainable because your mental game is way fucking, you're amped up, you're excited, and it's fucking sustainable. And then, what happens, because the way I diet people, they don't need any fucking food until they get down to the best version of themselves where they're actually lean enough that their body needs to take in dietary calories. Then they can eat at an actual four calo full, caloric deficit, full caloric capacity again. Where, they, where when you're losing weight the slow ass way via fucking Weight Watchers, you're eating at this chicken shit calorie deficit for so long, it's so hard to sustain that because you're never satisfied, ever. It's better to just smash the weight off, especially people that are like 20, 30 pounds overweight. You can smash that weight off in like a month or a month and a half and get right back to eating a full caloric intake and not gain a fucking pound back the way I eat, okay? Low success rate. Like, I was at Weight Watchers the other day. Because I had to go learn about this shit. So I went in there and I was like, had, we basically went and talked to the Weight Watchers people and they were giving us this bullshit spiel about how I could maybe lose 20 pounds in like 10 weeks. And you could even see that it was bullshit in the guy's eyes. And they're losing like, the success rate's so poor, there's like some obese woman in there coughing up another $300 to do their stupid fucking meetings and, you know, and use their number counting plan like the success rate's so fucking brutal they just they're so good at marketing it because they have so much money because the weight loss industry is fucking insane and makes like weight watchers makes like seven billion dollars a year on fucking this scam ripoff bullshit okay and it, it's mediocre results at best if any results half the people will do and they'll never get the fucking result i get fucking results my shit's fucking hard people my failure rate's very low, and it's usually at least if somebody does, they never do fail, because if, once I grind them through some hard fasts, they already have broke the fear of fasting. So you don't ever really fail. You can gain a couple pounds, and then it's like, oh, Cole taught me how to fast a long time ago. I know my body's capable of going like three or four fucking days without food. Just don't eat, and you'll lose the fucking fat, and you won't lose any muscle. So the, you can't really fail the way I do it, even sometimes... You might have somebody fall off the wagon during the coaching and fuck up, but then I just motivate them back in. And unless they fucking, they're being a fucking crybaby, you're always going to have some crybabies, and that's why this works so well, because it's fucking hard. It takes fucking, once you beat that, break that food addiction by grinding yourself through it, it's like bungee jumping, and that's what I, I'm like the guy that kicks you in the ass to fucking boot you off that platform, or else you're just going to sit there being scared, but once you've jumped once, it makes it easier and easier, and that's what I do with the fasting. I make them fast the first time and then longer and then longer until they're so, it's so easy to fast for days, especially if you're obese and you can't not fucking lose the weight and be super healthy and have no inflammation and all the other benefits that come from fasting, autophagy, fucking eating up fucking mutated fucking cancer, like cancer cells basically, like mutated fucking white blood cells, shit like this. 
So that's the difference. Losing weight fast keeps you fucking motivated. And you're blown away by the results and it keeps you in check. And even if the diet was difficult, you can still do it. Because a lot of times people don't... People... You know what? I got more faith in people by the day. Because when they know something's going to work, they'll fucking make... They'll do it to a T even if it's hard. When they don't know for sure some bullshit diet's going to work, then it's very hard to stay motivated. But if they know they're going to get results from fucking the way I teach... Um, open-ended fasting and a fasting-focused lifestyle, they know for a fact they will stick to the fucking exactly what you do, what we end up doing, like, right to the end till the fat is gone. So, everyone have a great day and fucking, it's always better to lose the fucking weight as fast as humanly possible because then you get to a nice equilibrium and you get back to homeostasis where your body's supposed to be with no fat and then you can eat a full caloric intake. Instead of fucking trying to cut fucking two pounds for a year straight. Like, who can stick to that shit? It's just like torture and never being satisfied. So everyone, have a great day. And fucking check out my YouTube channel, my Facebook page. Invite your friends to like my page. Instagram, Snake Diet Wizard on Instagram. My name's Cole Robinson. You can even add me on Facebook until my Facebook's right full. And get that fat in ya!